see an image of a woman who's flawed But I see a woman in the image of God Highest regards, a light of cigar Hello, hello, welcome dear viewers I am here and back doing an energy soul try brief For the lovely zodiac sign of Capricorn Stand up Capricorns all right before i get into your reading capricorns i just want to touch a little bit on the hurricane helene that um may have caused destruction and devastation and just sadness grief and even deaths um, due to the hurricane i know it reached a lot of states and I've been watching on the news and um, as well, looking on uh, YouTube, seeing different um, states and counties that were affected, power outages, houses destroyed, flood, cars flooded out. I mean, it was just horrible and sad. And my condolences to the people that's been affected in it. And I do know some people uh, still have outages. I just want to say that I'm thankful and grateful. Me and my mom was talking, you know, how where we live um, in the small counties where we live, we were not affected. No power outages, no damages, you know, just a little rain. And I'm so grateful and thankful, blessed for that, blessed. Uh, all of the above. But once again, my condolences to all those that were affected by this hurricane. Whew. Okay, with that being said, we are now going to get into your pre-energy read Capricorn. What I have for you is that you are going to be paid your worth. You're going to have recognition for your worth and your kindness um, in relationships. It's going to be equal sharing equal giving equal kindness um just overall generosity and i just want to say as well as far as like any definitely with any court cases um insurance payments or anything that's been anything that's owed to you you're definitely going to be um, treated fair in those situations um, like I said, in court cases, lawyer, anything or anybody that has that um, definitely owes you justice is going to be served. It's going to be good karma in those areas of your life. But I do see that you maybe now have just let go of people. Definitely just got to lean on that. Definitely let go of people in the past. Um, just like abandoning situations, relationships. Uh, changing your priorities, looking for a deeper meaning out of your life, maybe going on a soul searching, okay? You're trying to get self-control within your life. Definitely trying to get self-control and balance and um, just moderation within your life. You're trying to find a deeper meaning, a deeper purpose in your life, okay? Um, also, I do see it's going to definitely take um, patience and time, but over time, you will be, you will balance out your emotions and getting grounded within yourself and how you feel. Right now, you could definitely be juggling with finances, um, having ups and downs uh, within your money, but you know, just trying to juggling, juggling your money to get things paid and, you know, using different kind of resources to help you as well. Uh, like I say, you definitely left past people behind anybody, family, people that's, that's not giving you a deeper meaning out of your life. You walked away from them. You could be alienating a lot of people, others, and just sometimes some of those people might be there to help you, but you alienating them out the ones that's there to help you. So you could be like your worst enemy at times and just feeling like giving up on life, your um, your goals, your career, 
love everything you just feel like giving up and i want to say do not give up do not give up on yourself everybody goes through troubles trials okay hard times but keep going keep pushing don't give up on yourself believe main thing believe in yourself and that you're worthy i do see energy as far as like you're gonna be getting what you're what you're worth um in recognition of your self-worth i see uh definitely like some kind of talent or profession something that you've been working on you know just doing the groundwork trying to work hard at it practice makes perfect but believe in yourself uh you know right now you could not be believing in that talent and just um emotionally aloof moody volatile with people that's why i see you kind of just walking away just trying to seek for a deeper meaning if you're in that energy and you know not really controlling balancing your emotion it is best that you be away from people and get yourself together your emotions intact and seek out what you really want in life in your purpose Ooh. Yes, and I do see, you know, you believing in yourself and just keep going. You're going to get everything that you wish for. Definitely. You're going to be counting your blessings sooner than later. So don't give up on yourself. And this is a general reading for the Capricorn. So it may or may not resonate with all Capricorns. But if it does, you know what to do. Like, share, and subscribe. Comment at the bottom if you feel free. With that being said, we are now going to get into main part of the ted room let's see what we got here for capricorn Ooh, the heart's right here didn't want to go in but they go three we're gonna do a little bit more shuffling real quick and see what may come out what is the energy these two i'm definitely taking these two. Ooh, nine of swords somebody is going through some heartache and pain having sleepless nights okay definitely in regret and um, just having um, a lot of mental confusion in your mind Ooh, you definitely have a sleepless night but with the six of wands you're going to come out of that energy you're going to come out of that energy and it's going to be a lot of healing a lot of success coming as well as said and it goes in with your pre-energy reading you know feeling like giving up hope um and just giving up on your life but don't do that because it's going to be some positive changes definitely coming Ooh. oh and see energy come on come up here let's see what else is going to come out for capricorn Ooh, i don't want to go in so i'm going to take this one Ten of Pentacles. This is the family foundation, happy, happy foundation, uh, family foundation, uh, legacies, um, creating legacies, long term wealth, um, just complete happiness and loyalty um, within a fa um, family situation within your life is what you want. And I can see that, you know, you're taking the steps, the time out and planning, you know, certain situations to as far as within your family, people you love, friends, um, you definitely are, you know, just planning, taking time out, maybe wanting to travel, visit some. You're just planning to get everything in order and balance. Huh. All right. Yes, despite the energy before, if you're feeling like, you know, just in sadness and regret and feeling like giving up hope and on your life in general and everything. Some positive energy is out here and things will change change and turn around you got to believe that it will if you be negative and negative thoughts and negative thought pattern and don't think things is going to happen for yourself and that's what's going to manifest you got to change that Ooh, chariots okay charging forward moving forward in your life yes despite any obstacles you are charging and moving forward wonderful six of pentacles energy coming on up out here as well up in your pre-energy rate how i said there was going to be six of pentacles means equal give and take sharing reconciliation just 
kindness, what you put in somebody, the energy you put in somebody is what you're going to get back. Not one person sucking all the energy and being an energy vampire and just draining your energy. Whatever energy you put in somebody else is what you're going to be getting back. Wonderful, wonderful. We'll see you moving, charging forward in your life. Some Capricorns, there could be uh, a new car purchase as well. So that is good. Congratulations. All right. Yes. Energy coming through. This one to flip on out. So I'm going to take this one. Tower. Right, some kind of unexpected surprise is coming into your life, but this is going to be a good surprise. What is this surprise? It's unsuspected. Six of Swords. This is okay. It's going to be a surprise, but a good surprise. Six of Swords, baby. You moving away. It's same as going in with your pre energy read, what I saw. As far as you just. Moving to common waters within your life. You could be packing up your bags, moving away uh, to a different location, different city, different town, different state. You know, it could be going traveling as well on a trip, but you're definitely moving away from people that, you know, don't mean you good. Okay. Like, don't, like I said, don't seek a deeper meaning in your life. It just brings happiness. It may hurt you because these may be people that you love and, you know, care for. But love, I mean, you still can love them from a distance. Okay, but if, if the energy is not being received properly, eco rep, uh, uh, reciprocity, okay, within, this pe within these people in yourself. You're moving away from them. You're moving away from all the drama and the turbulence, okay? And moving to calmer, calmer waters. Oh, and geez. So, do what you got to do. You got to focus on yourself and do what's best for you. What you feel, not what everybody else wants you to do. Lord, okay? Energy coming out here for the Capricorn real quick. Three of Pentacles. Somebody that you really want to collaborate and just come together and work with in a relationship, at work, King of Pentacles. Okay. I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take this hey man because it actually fell down first with the King of Pentacles was in my hand. So this is you have went within. I said you walked away from people you're seeking a deeper meaning out of your life. You went within and you got a light bulb thought idea of who it is that you want to be together with um collaborate with in life just be a soulmate a teammate i don't want to say soulmate because i ain't seen that yet but just really come together with them in a, in a relationship teamwork makes the dream work you realize who it is that you want to work together who you want to be with period king of pentacles Okay, from you juggling finances, things maybe not going your way, career goals, whatever, you're definitely going to be ch charging moving forward within your life, being grounded and stable within your money. You're going to be happy and content. Okay, King of Pentacles, father figure who's strong, who's a hard worker, who's grounded, okay, within their money and their finances. You have the dog out here, you could like dogs, pets. Um, dogs also represent loyalty. You need that loyalty in your life to others and to yourself. You're going to get definitely breakthrough of clarity. The Ace of Swords on the bottom, some truth definitely coming within your life and what you want, what you're going to get. Okay, moving forward. Woo. What you want and what you're going to get. Boy, do you see these two cards? OMG, these two cards right here just flipped up right down here on this King of Pentacles. So I said, what you want, what you want to get. Nine of Cups is wish fulfillment, getting what you want, okay? Not just financially in relationships in life. These two cards have flipped up here sideways 
on this king of pentacles let me show you what you want five of cups somebody who you had past relationship with who the love was lost that you separated that's the person who you want with this four of pentacles you holding on to them to that energy to their life okay that is what you want who you want <laughs> omg okay you definitely it's definitely you're in definitely regret and sad from a relationship that was lost it could be other people that may be coming around chances that you get but the only person you can think about is that cup that true love that soul mate that was lost now i feel the energy now omg that soulmate that was lost. That's the only person you can really think about and who you want. Okay. Very lot of sadness and regret. Holding on to their life. Ooh. OMG. If this bitch will feel me out here, Nine of Cups, you might could be getting the person that you're trying to hold on to that you want. You know, but, you know, it takes two to tango. Both energies got to be involved. And I see you might be trying to manifest this person. Uh, back in your life we're getting ready to end this up here for capricorn quick reading but yes definitely somebody that you just in total regret with that you lost from a love relationship now period this five of cups you can definitely sadness over this relationship king of cups okay you're gonna be if you get this person back you just see a quick communication coming in peeking out here see the lovers Gemini, Leader, Aquarius, Two Cups, King of Cups. You're going to be full of emotion and ready to express emotion for this person, period, that you're trying to hold on to. OMG. Quick, fast communication that ready to come in over the line, over the internet, over platforms that you could be seeing. This person, you're ready to take a risk. You went within yourself. You're ready to take a risk. And just start a new beginning with them. OMG. And risk it all. And express how you feel. Whew. We're going to end this on up. Once again, this is a general reading for Capricorn. We're not going to get further on into this. But if it resonates with you, Capricorns, like, share, and subscribe. If it does not, leave it to the Cisnot. And let it ride. Sally ride. And as I always say. Pray, pray, meditate, namaste, you girls out, have a, full, have a wonderful blessed day, love and light.